Hi, I'm Jonathan Alter. I'm currently on vacation with my family in Europe, thus the beard. Um, my concerns about Trump are threefold. I think he uh, will very likely um, get us into some kind of unnecessary military conflict um, because history tells us that wars start with taunts. And Trump has said that he believes in hitting back, quote, times 10, unquote, uh, when he is uh, insulted. And I think if he's president, that will then become when the United States is insulted. Uh, and we know um, from the origins of World War I and other wars that uh, it's very easy to miscalculate your way into war. Trump, I believe, is likely to do so. I also think that history suggests that Trump will create a global uh, recession or even depression. Um, the Smoot-Hawley tariff of 1930 was one of the um, big factors leading to the Great Depression. Um, presidents have the ability to unilaterally um, erect trade barriers. Trump has said that he wants to put a 40 to 45 percent tariff on Chinese goods. He can do quite a lot of that by himself, even if it doesn't go that high will trigger a trade war that will be devastating for the global economy. His lack of predictability and reliability um, will also be harmful uh, to investment uh, and uh, productivity. Um, and I also think that um, we know um, from our study of history that character is destiny and that ultimately the character and temperament um, of uh, leadership uh, has enormous ramifications uh, down through government and society. Um, there's voluminous evidence uh, that Donald Trump is a con man um, and has conned many uh, people over the years uh, and continues to do so. And it would be a very dangerous road for the United States to go down to uh, put a con man uh, in charge uh, of uh, the government and in possession of the nuclear codes. So um, I think uh, this is not a normal presidential election. It's outside the, the bounds that we normally uh, look at um, where you know politicians disagree. This is not uh, Carter versus Ford in 1976 or Clinton versus Dole in 1996 or Obama versus Romney in 2012. This is, this is outside the normal range uh, of uh, presidential elections and therefore uh, calls on, I think, all of us, historians, journalists, and others, um, to not try to normalize it, um, but to uh, identify uh, this candidacy for, for what it is, which is uh, a threat to our country. Thanks.